Um, if you could introduce yourself and the school you're associated with. So I'm uh, Tom Cannon and I work at Blackheath High School and the team that we submitted this year was, was Team Cannons. That's, is that a coincidence that they named themselves after you? Uh, no, actually, they, I asked them to come up with a team name. They couldn't think of anything. They looked around the room, saw me and said, right, Team Cannons, and that was it. I tried to dissuade them. <laughs> I'm not that big-headed, but unfortunately, that was the one they were on and they wouldn't budge. It's no surprise that you are so popular and you won the most outstanding mm, yeah. teacher. Very, very, very huge well, congratulations thank you. to you. Thank you. How does it feel, Mr. Cannon? Ah, uh, it's so, uh, I know how hard all, all teachers work, whether they're, it's woha, just generally day to day. And, and so to win something like this, to be recognized for all the hard work that teachers put in, I just, it just makes you feel everything was worth it. And uh, I know the pupils, they have to submit their, uh, who they want to kind of win. And so to feel that the pupils really sort of wanted, you know, recognize the hard work that I put in and the hard work they did just makes you feel even better. That's lovely. Um, Ms. Cannon, if I could ask you from the perspective of a teacher who is obviously juggling a lot of um, commitments and yeah. has a lot of time constraint on her or his slave, um, why did you accommodate something like WOHA within mm. your schedule and encourage your students to take part in? I think with education there is such a focus on um, getting the grades, doing well in exams, but I want my students to leave school and not only do very well in their exams, but actually to have a real perception of what is going on around the world, to really value what, what they've got. Not every student um, is going to have maybe the best home life or, or not to say they haven't had their own struggles but if they can truly appreciate what they have because so many people around the world have nothing at all then I think that's just as important as doing well in your exams plus they enjoy doing it, it's such a great thing to do so they get, they're having fun, they're enjoying what they do but at the same time they are getting educated and they understand a little bit more about what's going on around the world. And uh, thank you so much for saying that and do you think in terms of tying up the um, you know, the ethos of un appreciating the other struggles whilst themselves learning to you know, developing this sense of giving back to the community do you think Hoha is important and doing the right kind of work? Absolutely. There are a lot of schemes out there, but Woha to me is the one that is the most important and the one that I've enjoyed working with the most. Um, and so I just think in terms of, of schools being involved with something like this, this should be at the top of everyone's list. That's lovely. Thank you so much. Thank you so right. much. Thank you so much.